hundreds of the latest high-tech devices now on display at this year's Consumer Electronics Show in Vegas. That includes gadgets from more than 20 companies right here from North Carolina. And joining us from the floor of CMS now is tech expert Paul Hawkman. So what are some of the coolest devices on display this year, Paul? Well, that's actually a really hard question to answer. There's so many cool ones. We've assembled five that we think are highlights. Um, and I'll start with sound, because sound matters to so many customers and so many consumers. When they connect to their audio devices, they want to hear great sound. When they connect to their movies, they want to hear great sound, as it was intended. What that requires is a great set of headphones. Um, but traditionally, to get great sound, you had to plug into headphones. Um, now, Audio Technica has just introduced the M50X BT. BT stands for Bluetooth, which obviously means wireless. It does have a wired capability if you'll want it, but the best thing about it is that the sound is pretty much approximates what you would get if you did plug in. Uh, and that, that's a breakthrough, breakthrough for a lot of people. So you get the best of both worlds. You don't have to be plugged in, but you do get that quality sound that the, uh, that the producers intended. About car and auto technology, what's hot this year with that? Sure. A lot of people talking about self-driving cars. I'd like to talk for a second about self-entertaining cars. Um, Honda has something called the Dream Drive system, which actually has something for just about everybody in the vehicle. Up front, uh, grown-ups, so the ostensibly grown-ups in the front, uh, can control apps that are integrated with the car itself. For example, make reservations at restaurants that know how far away they are because the car is communicating with the restaurant, and that, that app itself, Yelp in this case, can actually make the reservation based on that time. Meanwhile, in the back, Kids are entertained with custom entertainment built for the car, and they can control their climate in their individual seats. So fewer complaints from the back, happier uh, grown-ups up front makes for a better drive. Well, that's pretty cool. We talked a little bit about cars, but what about the technology around the house? Sure. Uh, let's start with robotic technology for the house. Um, Eva, Ecovax, pardon me, makes something called the Dbot Osmo 960 which is a great name. What it is is a robotic vacuum and mop. Um, it's AI powered, so it learns, but it also has VI, or visual interpretation, which basically means that it learns, it interprets what it sees in front of it, and learns not to drive over, for example, uh, shoelaces, or power cords, which would otherwise tangle it. And that's, that's a great development for anybody who wants to clean the home. Then, speaking of the home, Yumly, a cooking app. Whirlpool now works with Yumly. It, and Yumly has uh, recipes that actually are designed for how much time it, it will take between now and when your kids show up for dinner. So if you have 30 minutes is the answer to that question, what can I make in 30 minutes? Guess what? All those recipes show up and you uh, can connect to those Whirlpool devices remotely and even preheat the oven on the way home through the app. Very um, nice. Probably my, yeah. my favorite product here, it, it, yeah, and I'm, I think these are great. My favorite so far, frankly, is uh, the last of these, which is uh, called Flow by Moen. Moen partnered with uh, Flow Technologies, FLO Technologies, uh, to create a water monitoring device that really is going to revolutionize how you manage water in the house. Uh, it monitors your water, it, it detects leaks, that's great. But if there is a leak, or say worse, there's a burst pipe, the system detects it and automatically shuts off water to your home in your house so that the leak, which would have gone on maybe all day if you were at work or all week if you were on vacation, is shut off before it even gets, starts, basically. Uh, water, the, the, that's, that management is unbelievable and is a real power to anybody who has a house and is worried about that kind of damage. Yeah, that's fantastic, especially for folks who live in areas that are prone to uh, pipes freezing yep. deep in the winter time. Could help them out a lot. That, that's exactly right. Frozen pipes can mean literally hundreds of thousands of dollars in damage. No doubt about it. Thanks so much, Paul. Thanks so much. Great stuff there. Can't wait to see it come out on the market. I know. I'm excited to see it, too.